Well, uh, Royal Oak is known for its vibrant downtown, attracting hundreds of people every night. But a proposed ordinance in the city may soon be keeping the noise down. Priya Mann joins us with how the proposal is targeting loud noise and music coming from both motorcycles and cars. Maybe you've been that driver or you've been annoyed by someone playing their music real loud. Well, the city of Royal Oak is considering making it easier for police to ticket people playing their music loud or with those noisy motorcycle mufflers. Downtown Royal Oak is usually buzzing with activity, but for those that disrupt the daily hum of the city, you've been warned. Royal Oak wants to crack down on people with excessively loud music and engines. I think that people should be able to enjoy their music. It's not going to hurt anybody, so there's no need for it. The city wants to make noise violations a civil infraction with tickets ranging from 50 to $100. To be ticketed, vibrations need to be heard from at least 50 feet away. Right now, it's a criminal misdemeanor, which carries a higher burden of proof and is harder to fight in court. A civil infraction would make it easier for police to ticket violators. It's geared towards those that are, are being obnoxious with their, their stereos. They put the stereos so loud that they drown out everything and, and disrupt people, and, and it, that's what we're going after. Reaction to the idea is mixed. We love Royal Oak how it is. All they're trying to do is get more tickets, and all that's going to do is push us away from Royal Oak, and we'll go downtown Detroit. And if you don't know, I play music loudly in the car. I definitely do. Um, and if I were to get charged with anything, I'd rather it be an infraction. The owner of K2 Media welcomes the change, saying the noise is more than a nuisance. Located in the heart of downtown Royal Oak, he says the change will be good for business. So it's to a point where my staff has to wear headphones. It's so loud and so earth shattering that they can feel the rumbling on their desk. So when they have a desk job trying to concentrate on specific work, it's, it's impossible. And the mayor says the city will have a second reading of the motion at the end of the month. If it passes, it could go into effect by mid-August. Reporting from Royal Oak, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4.